Coming up next on RB Comics, The Spectre, Protector of Memphis. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, put your hands together for the one, the only, Miss Atomic Bomb. Well, hello, my little pyromaniacs. This is your literal bombshell, Miss Atomic Bomb, live and loaded within this undisclosed location a lady never reveals her secrets it's my first annual miss atomic bombs fan art showcase video for the past few weeks i've received all your fan arts of little old me in my natural habitation styling profiling and flaunting what my mama gave me well actually Daddy was the one who paid for him, but that's not the point. All these came out from a deviant art, well, some artwork site where nerds post their little cartoon gals from bad television. Y'all should get out some more and talk to real women like moi. <laughs> now, without further ado, let's get this wagon train rolling. Excuse me? What in the hell is wrong with my face? It looks like I tried to flip a pancake with my nose. Based on my expertise of natural talent and one art class, I think that qualifies me to say that arms don't bend that way. Next. Ooh, well there I am. And there they are. Who the devil are all these men standing over me? No one stands over me. Especially not an OC, whatever that is. I guess it looks good though. Hey, you didn't draw this, you just commissioned it. <laughs> now, I love cheating as much as the next gal, but that dog don't hunt here, Fox. Nice try. Now, my little automaton. It would appear that this entry has a little bit of a story here. Hmm. Jessie Baum, that's me, previously paroxysm before she changed her name on account of how nobody could pronounce it right. What do you mean nobody could pronounce it right? I thought that when she received an invitation to what claimed was a golden opportunity for her benefit, that it referred to a potential reality show about her. Ooh, that is a good, I like where this is going. Where the hell she gets these ideas, God only knows. And I'd prefer he keep that one to herself. Learning where she gets her ideas would kill off brains. What? What kind of story is this? I'm not even gonna dignify it by reading the rest of it. Good grief. Ooh, my. Bangin' Betty was right. Never missing leg day was the next best thing to the surgery. My face could be a bit better, but that's nothing a bit of paint and cutting can't fix, right? <laughs> this is giving me ideas for my next bombastic adventure, but where's the rest of my dress? I can't be going around with my biddies out for the world to see. <laughs> What kind of gal do y'all think I am? <laughs> well, my face does look like one of them, what you call them, Bratz dolls? <laughs> but animating in 3D is tray hard. <laughs> and everything else looks fabulous. My girls just jump right off the page. This strapping lady next to me doesn't look so bad herself. <laughs> Honey, don't you worry now. 
After this, a part of you will be all over here. 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 <laughs> What a gorgeous work of art! The shading and the texture of them atomic explosions just creates a sense of intensity. The flair, the agony, the pain. Finally, in full frontal view is moi, sitting upon my explosive throne, riding the waves of white maroon dust. And I do look a tad rough around the legs and facial area. But I do adore the attempts at stylization. My God! I'm beautiful! Those pearls, those eyes, my luscious lips. It's all so fabulously highlighted and shadowed. There's even texture in my $50,000 gown. It's a masterpiece that will last the ages. Of course, it helps that it has such a classic subject. Wouldn't you agree? Well, that's it for this installment, darlings. Thank you so much for your support and for sending in your portraits honoring me, your glorious cannonball cutie, Miss Atomic Bomb. Y'all come back now, you hear? Hashtag Miss Atomic Bomb. Hashtag Explosive Artwork. Hashtag Deviant Art. Hashtag Bombastic. Ladies and gentlemen, that will be all for Miss Atomic Bomb. Good day and good night. <laughs>